Now I gotta get my stereo set up. I got this thing in college, or I've had this thing since college. Maybe even high school, I'm not sure. Just a good old fashioned amplifier. When I'm transcribing, I still prefer to do it from a CD where I can push pause and play and all that. Anyway, this is what, uh, for the young folks out, it's nothing amazing, but this is what powers the stereo system. This CD player actually has a mini disc. Can you see this? It has a mini disc player right there. Perhaps when uh, I get all unpacked and settled in, I will show you what a what a mini disc looks like. This is just crappy speaker wire. Analog, baby. Confession, I have no idea what I'm supposed to connect this antenna wire to. There's like all these little buttons that say AM, FM, ground, lift. There's a lot of little things that you're supposed to screw these wires into. I don't really know. I just kind of put it on one and then I move it around. I don't even really listen to the radio, so. <laughs> try it now, but I don't have any CDs. They are all still in storage. I found one CD. This is actually um, this guy, Alexandre Silverio, Sil Silverio. I'm sure that I'm mispronouncing his name. I met him recently. He's one of my students online, but he's a ridiculously awesome bassoon player. Look him up, seriously. You gotta see the video of him playing bassoon to a Michael Brecker solo.